in this video, I'll be showing you how to get the third RB Battles Relic in Adopt Me. Oh wait, this isn't Adopt Me? Hmm, okay, well this is uh, Robloxy in high school, and I'll be showing you how to get the relic here. Uh, I looked at a few more things, and this looks almost exactly like Adopt Me, but with slightly different menus. First, you need to be at the school, so if you don't know where that is, sometimes on the screen it's just gonna say, Hey, attend this class, and then you can press go, and then if you go outside of the school at the front right here, which where I am, I'm gonna show you guys exactly where you need to go. So you need to go to the library, and so just like go inside, and then the library is right here, so just turn left and then go inside of the library. Once you're in the library, again, it has to be anywhere in between 7 and 8 a.m., so I'm gonna have to wait until that time happens. But you just gotta sit in this chair. Also, you can just go over to explore and then press school to teleport there. There we go, we got the key. So if you do this in a VIP server, you can actually, like, whenever you restart it, you can go really fast. Like, right when you get in, you press explore and then teleport to the front of the school and then run in here, and you can get here here probably at like 6 30 7 30 also you should press this button right here to sprint so that you can go even faster but then the key will spawn right here and you can just press e to pick it up but now you're gonna have to go this way towards the classrooms area and then turn left there's gonna be a door that has no sign on it past the workshop and that is right here so once you use that, then it's going to open up and there is actually a portal right here. So you're going to want to go through the portal, your screen is going to darken and it's going to teleport you to an obby area. So I'm thinking that you just have to do the obby, there might be some other stuff. Oh yeah, definitely turn off sprint for this because, well, it's a little bit harder to do this whenever you're going super fast. But this is all like kind of a basic obby, like you guys know how in all of those Roblox obbies how they have the tree climb. They just added like it is the leaves are specially shaped and there are some lava blocks on them. But if you've done other obbies on Roblox before you're probably going to do good at this. Oh no I fell, yeah I'm just gonna speed this up because this might take a little bit. Actually I guess the key can spawn anywhere around you but you'll definitely see it. And also, whenever you go over here, if you, like, fell the first time, then you're, if you fell at all, you're gonna have to, like, start from the beginning again. But if you die to, like, one of the kill blocks, then you'll just teleport to the start again. But, yeah, you're gonna have to go back here, but now let's speed this up. Actually, now whenever I fall, it teleports me back here, but this obby is so long, it's basically impossible. This is gonna take forever to beat. I, I actually got past that part. I turned on sprint and I just randomly jumped, hoping I wouldn't touch the lava thing. Oh no, I hope the rest of this isn't really that hard. Okay, that looks like it's very hard to do. Oh no. Oh no. Yeah, this obby is like way too hard and... Everyone is gonna have to do this to actually get the relic here. Oh no. Yeah, it's gonna be like almost impossible for anyone to get it. Anyways, let's try this right now, I guess. So I gotta go over here and then I'm gonna sprint so I can actually like jump over. Uh oh. I forgot those were falling. Yep, I'm just gonna hide behind that. And it looks like the best thing to. Wait, is that the end? Oh? I hope that's the end. If I die on this, I'm gonna just, like, be so sad. Yeah, that's good. We're- What? That- It literally spawned on me! How is that fair? I just spent 400 Robux on gems to get the glider, and I can't equip it during the obby. I wish that it told me that before, because, uh, well, RIP 400 Robux, I guess. After multiple attempts and a lot of questioning if I should even try to get this item, uh, I'm finally back here. If it spawns on me again, though, I am going to be very disappointed. But, 
it shouldn't spawn on me because I mean why would it even spawn on me like it literally just spawned on me earlier that is like so not epic gamer that's just, like it's out of epic gamer that is zero but uh let's attempt this again and this time I'm just gonna do the same thing you know go over here try to be sneaky wait for it to spawn and go past me and then if I'm actually being very careful, then I can do pretty well. So let's just go over here. That's going to spawn there. And then after that, well, I'm going to... Wait, can I jump through this? I'm not going to, like, risk anything. Let's just go through there real quick. And then I think I'm going to be good up here. What? I didn't even touch the thing. Also, for some parts of the obby, you're going to have to turn on sprint to actually do them. Like this one right here, because there was kind of a long jump. I have finally done it! I- I figured out a pattern for those, you gotta jump over two of them at once! Oh, I was pretty close to that one, yeah, I should probably stay on this end. But now for the next part of the obby. Why do they have some of these as decoration? That's like not what you're supposed to do in an obby. If you have parts of the obby that look like decoration, then people are gonna just get very confused. I- I'm just gonna go down here, I'm pretty sure- WHAT?! HOW?! Well, I guess I literally have to do this again. Why would they put decoration in a range where you could literally jump there? Okay, I'm finally back, but this literally extends to back here, so it makes it look a lot like you're gonna have to jump there. And there are even, like, other small things by it that looks exactly like what you have to do. But there's literally nowhere else to go, so I'm gonna try going right there. Whoa, that actually worked. And then there are some dark things under here. Maybe I, I I don't really... Um, Yeah, that looks like the only thing I can jump on from right here. There's nothing really else that I can do. Okay, let's just try jumping there. Whoa, I didn't fall off. Okay. And then it looks like the next really dark thing is right there. Oh, no, that's like way too far away. Yeah, I couldn't really tell that how far it was from that. Now I'm gonna have to redo the obby again. They literally made it so confusing at the end right there. It won't even let me join the game right now. Okay, well I guess I'm gonna try one more time with the one below it. Because this is the only one that I can actually reach. So like, if this doesn't work, I'm gonna be very surprised and disappointed. Oh, it actually let me go here. One of my friends is also trying to get here, and I asked him, and he said to jump into the void. Uh, I guess I'm gonna just do it. Oh, it teleported me somewhere! Wait, no, what? It teleported me back to- oh. After doing that, you're supposed to literally just jump off the map into the void whenever you're standing there, and it's supposed to teleport you to one of the island things by it. And then you'll actually see the item there, and you can just touch it to claim it. I jumped off. Like, my friend literally got it and told me what to do after that, because my friend just got it about maybe one minute ago. But yeah, you're supposed to do that. I literally did that, and it did nothing at all. But that's what you're supposed to do to get it. So I guess it's kind of glitched. Like, it didn't even teleport me back to the beginning. It teleported me back to my house again. So this is literally glitched. I'm going to have to redo the entire thing again when it was supposed to give it to me. Anyways, that's how you get this item. It's super stressful. It doesn't even work. It's I, I hope they fix that soon, though. It's working for some people because it worked for my friend about a minute ago, but it didn't work for me. But yeah, make sure to subscribe with the notifications on for more videos on the Ready Player 2 event. I really hope that they do make this easier. Like the video, join the Discord server linked in the description, and follow my Twitter at Telanthric, and use star code Telanthric to support my channel. But I'll see you all in the next video.